What's going on guys? Roger and Omar from OTI Gaming TV. Yo, yo. And today, we've got a little money, credit, unlimited gift for you guys. Omar's going to run it because he knows more about this game than I do. Take away everything. First of all, you need to buy one of these car guys. You need to buy the Forza Edition M6 BMW. That's what you need to buy. For those of you that don't know how to buy it, go to the festival auction, type in BMW, but Omar will show you. Yeah, if you it. don't know how to do it, guys, you just go to the H, which is located here. You jump to the Horizon Festival. You go inside the Horizon Festival. You find it. You buy it. Right. And what you want to do, guys, is you want to go and... Raja, you can do this as well, yeah? So press the, uh, like, options button. Yep. Menu. Now, majority of people will have what I got at the top, which is it says cars, and it'll say like nine plus. Yeah. You probably got like a million of them. No, it says nine plus as well. But yeah. Yeah. Uh, you click on where it says car mastery. Okay, X. Unlock perk. So the first perk on this is already bought, which is gain your like instant five thousand credits. You don't really care about them; they're, they're pointless. What you want to start looking for is stuff like this. So it says get 10% more influence when driving. Yeah, I look drift. Yep. So look at the one above it. Wreckage. The first one it says drift. So I'm unlock that for three. I don't really have many guys. We're gonna gain loads on this though. So yeah. I'm doing then everything. I'm just gonna buy do maybe. Yeah, you can do them all because you got you got loads of points. I don't. We're gonna make points in this video and show them what we're gonna do. So I'm just gonna buy this one anyway. Here's another tip for you guys, which most people don't know, is if you yeah. actually do have one where it says custom sound system, you can read what it says there, it says the car builds the skill multiplier much faster, you'll leave the radio on, and it'll find a certain song playing, and when it does, it'll say at the top in yellow, uh, this is a multiplier song, so just drift, crash, drive around, do mad shit, and it will um, multiply it quick times, so I'm going to buy that anyway. This last one is always 25. Always. Like, always. <laughs> so, that's because it gives you the chance not to lose your multiplier, basically. Oh, is it if you crash? Yeah, that's that's the one that's the guardian angel. So, if you crash and oh. I crash, I'll lose my points, but you won't. If you crash again, then you'll I will. lose them then. Okay, I've maxed out everything. Yeah, so you got flying car, you don't really want that. Ultimate thrill, no. Drive without fear, no. no. See, stuff like that, your car's multiplier builds three or times as fast. It costs five, so I'm gonna buy that. <coughs> so I need to make more so I can buy this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, all these guys. So we're gonna make the points now. The... I'm gonna show you exactly how to make yeah. the points. So, get your points and then I'm going to show you how to spend your points and get cars and get money basically. Cars, as you can see, it's just dead. So I'm just doing mad stuff here guys. I'm just, I'm already at 40,000. I know I am 11. Wow. And the more you do this, the more points you end up with, the more points you end up with, the more stuff you end up with and then you can just keep doing it and doing it and doing it and you'll end up with everything. But the more points you get, then you get cars as well, right? I'm going to stop here again. So I'm on 16.8 times 5 already, guys. I'm only doing it slowly to show you how, how you can get the skill points. Look, I got one. Boom. I got two. 40,000 times 7. We need to go to... Um, the Horizon Festival. Right, so you jump to the Horizon Festival. Old one. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna go to any. Which one is it? So, it's this one here. The Porsche 911 Turbo 3.3 1982. So I'm just gonna buy this outright. Look, I'm gonna buy it. Oh, I see it. 1982. Got it. Yeah, so I'm gonna buy this one outright, yeah? Look, car. So Rajah's gonna do the same thing in the background, guys. Done it. And he's gonna tell you exactly what happens on his screen, because his screen's gonna be different to my screen, because I don't have a lot of points. But he's gonna show you what you have to do. 
So remember, you need to buy the Porsche 911 Turbo 3.3 1982. So what you want to do now is go back to where it says cars on the menu. Yep, back I'll to the car let, let me record this now. So I'm going to record it from my angle. Not recording. Yeah, I'm on cars. Yeah, so now go to the the look. What do you see? Oh, it's already got five out of six perks on it already. Yeah, but what do you see? Oh, okay. we will see. So if you look money. very carefully, yeah, oh. look, 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 look. if you see very carefully now, mm. what you do, guys, is you buy the first one, which is already bought on this car. You buy the second one, which will cost you one, and three is four. That makes it nine. Mine's already bought. So you need 19 points to give you 300,000. That's how the glitch works, guys. That's basically the top and tail of it. You buy that car, you earn the points. You earn the points, you buy this car, you spend the points on this car, and then you get 300,000 every time. Yo, go, yo, guys, okay, so we're carrying on from the previous video because most of you guys got stuck on how to repeat the glitch that we did before. So the first step was to get the M6, get the points from the M6. I'm summarizing the video so you guys can watch the video already. Summarizing. Get the M6, get the drift points, get the drift points, buy the Porsche. Once you have that Porsche, you get 300k. That's correct, now. You buy the That's thing, right. you get 300k. Yeah. Then, if you want to rinse and repeat that, you need to sell your current Porsche, which I'm going to check right now because I need to sell it before I even... He's going to buy the car fresh now, guys. And what's going to happen is we've done the trial and error. We tried to show you it that way. That way didn't work. So what we're going to do now is show you this way where you don't make the full amount because you have to spend to make, basically... Well, you still be flipping 150. Basically. So you buy it for 150. And you right? get 300 back. And then you'll be making 300. There you go. Then you sell it again. Then you buy another one. Instead of removing it like I did, you can always sell your car, guys. I'm just doing it for you because I don't really care. I've got, I've got millions. Exactly. Right. So we're just going to show you guys exactly how to do it the one way, the second way, and this is the guaranteed way. So now we've got a fresh car, guys. Your points should come back. Remember, you're going to get wheel spins and everything. So make sure you got the points. That's the main thing. By the process of elimination, this should work, guys. So, literally. And if this works, yes, there you go. There you go. All right, there you go, guys. You got all the points back now, guys. See, so I can literally just scale up back and get a wheel spin. I'll get most of my money back, right? Let's just see. Let's just do it now. So, I'm spending my points, guys. So, let's let's just go through the steps again that we did then. All right, get rid of all your porches that you have. That's what I did, okay? If you don't want to do that. Buy a brand new Porsche, which is 150k, and see if it works. If it doesn't, do what I did. Literally, get rid of all your Porsches, remove them, sell them, I don't care. Go to, um, not the auction house, the garage. Buy a brand new Porsche, it's 150k. Remember, this glitch will give you 300k every time, so you're technically doubling your money, all right? 300k, take away 150k, it's still 150k left over, all right? So, I'm going to do a wheel spin. Let's just see how much I can win with that. So, you're going to spend 150k, but let's see straight away how much money you're going to get. So, I'm spinning it now. Look at that guys, I want a skirt, I didn't want to fuck all day, but I got a skirt. Go. <coughs> Carrying on. Alright, now I'm buying this up here. Three points over there. Going up here. Five points here. Going up here. And there's my money right there. I just made 300k guys. Now in the first time you do this, you're obviously going to get a car with zero perks on it. Because it's a, you, even when you're buying it, when you're following the first steps, me and Omar bought a used car from the auction, right? And we had no points on the Porsche whatsoever. Then, to repeat the process, make sure you got points, follow the M61, drift around, go to the um, Horizon Festival and buy yourself a brand new Porsche, and then you'll keep making 150k. Because you're going to be spending 150k, but then you keep rinsing and repeating, you keep rinsing and repeating, and keep rinsing and repeating. So I just made 300k now, alright? I'm not, I'm going to save my points. And that's it guys, then you just keep doing the same thing, literally same thing. So to break it down so you understand, like, very quick and easy, you can either go to the auction house and spend 35,000 and keep buying them and potentially just waste that 35 because it's already been put on there or you can do the guaranteed method which is right at the very end of this video which he just showed you now and yeah that, that, that is the 100% guaranteed way to do it you get rid of all your Porsches and you buy a fresh one you will lose out 150k like you said but then if you keep doing it eventually you'll end up being up anyway so you're always gonna be up guys like you yeah it's 300k take away 150 but you're always basically glitching out 150 after that so in the beginning you're glitching out 300k but there on after you get 150k every time because obviously you have to buy the car over and over and over and over and over and over again
See, he could do it so now, over and over, guys. He could sell this car or just remove it. He could take that loss of 150k and remove it. But minor, it's not a problem. And then buy another one. That's it. Same yep. again. He's got 300k. So now he's made 300k. Might have lost 300k, but he's made 300k. You get it. So it's still up. So the best way to do it, guys, buy the brand new Porsche, right? Sell this one. Buy another brand new one. You make 150k every time, every time, every time, every time. And then you keep rinsing and repeating. So if you do this 10 times, right, you made 1.5 million profit plus the original 300k plus all the wheel spins you're going to get. That's so, you know what I mean? You're probably going to be making about easy. I'm just going to easy put your maths over there, like two, two mil, maybe no, 2.5 million, maybe more. Because you're going to keep getting the wheel spins. Every time you buy the car, you're going to have to put the points in the wheel spin, put the wins up, get the 300k, then sell this one and then buy a brand new one. If you don't want to sell it, just remove it, get a new one. Or don't even remove it, just go buy a new one if you have to. Then you've got all these Porsches waiting for you to sell later on. Do you know what I mean? But anyway, guys, like, share, comment, subscribe. Easy glitch. Follow all the steps, and I guarantee you'll be making money. No long.